Hello, this is Amazing Lego Stuff 41, and this is my update number three. Um, I haven't made a video in about a month now, so I have a lot to cover in my update. About a month ago, it was my birthday, so I got a lot of new Lego sets, or Shima. Shima. Um, so we'll get a new variety, more Lego pieces, so I can build more of a variety of things like mocks. Um, also, I have I I have um, some Lego pieces that I might build the GBC with for a bulk contraption. Um, but it's kind of hard to build one, so I might not. I got those for my birthday too. Um, also, I will not be building my Lego Kano Machine V10 or my Lego house because I don't have the pieces. I don't have enough red pieces to build that way. Even though I can build like five things at once with only Lego pieces. Red pieces since I have tons of red pieces. Um, also, I might be building some more um, candy machines. Uh, mostly dispensers. If anyone can post a video response about how to build a two option candy machine, that would be great. Um, because I really want to build one and I don't know how. So, um, that would be really nice. Also, now I think I'll be showing you my little Shima sets that I got. I got a lot more, but I'll only be showing the main two. This is the Eagle. I don't really know what to call either of them, so I'll just say the Eagle plane. Um, has a really nice head, has some jointage, which can, can go back and forth. And then it opens up nicely, and then you figure you can sit in there, and there's a little control thing. Two guns, which are supposed to be eyes, right here, and the beak. I really like the design of the beak. It just looks really like one piece. Um, the legs move, but they're kind of hard to position, and the claws move. The wings move, a full, like, 360, pretty much. And then there's two flip fire, a flip fire missile right here. You can see right there, and both wings are exactly the same, so I'll only be showing you one. In the back, there's these three wings, and I'll just lift this up the other way um four wings and right here there's a jail and a place to store the g crystals now i have lots of g crystals because i got so many sets but this is what they look like um they're just really nice they can stick to stuff because they have studs and to show you how much g crystals i got i got this many which is really a lot since I got most of the um, speed ores and a lot of chili sets, so that's nice. And then also, I got in that set this little thing. It looks really nice. It has two minifigure weapons right here and two wings. And in the back, just this, two controls. And it's a pretty simple build, but it's still really nice. And then I got this wolf vehicle. It looks like a wolf a lot. And it has this really big uh, missile right here. And we'll fire that um, later. The wheels can spin very nicely. It barely has suspension. And these ears right here, these um, were quite hard to build. So I had to make a lot of, a lot of modifications to this. Um, see. I had to build my own custom section since one piece I couldn't really put on. I think I built it a little wrong. But anyway, and the, in the front, there's this um, it's a cockpit. There's a steering wheel in there, that steering wheel, and these can open up for the eyes. There's a wolf in there. And on the side, this cannot move, but the fire can turn, which is kind of cool. And in the back, the second main feature is this unraveling chain, which can, is supposed to grab the enemies, or in this case, the good guys. 
grab them, but it's kind of hard to do that since there's only two claws and there's no claws on the other side. So, and then you can just uh, ink that back up. Like so. And I'll show you how far the missile shoots in a minute. Um, here's me shooting it. So, as you can see, it goes pretty far. It's the black speck uh, right there. Um, and it's easy to reload and shoot. Which is pretty much covers this. So, that's my update number three. Thank you for watching. Please click